Hi everyone and welcome to my YouTube channel. Um, today I am going to be doing a post review of everydayedeals.com. I think that's how you say it. Uh, so this one is called Forest Bridge and it is a 30 by 40 centimeter uh, with round diamonds. So when they say 30 by 40, they're actually counting the whole canvas, including this border on the top and bottom, as you can see. Uh, so when you actually measure it, not sure if you can read those numbers, but this one is 25 centimeters across and 35 centimeters in length. So um, you lose a little bit because of that border. So sometimes they'll tell you online if it's the drill area that's 30 by 40 or sometimes they don't specify and in this case I got a little bit of a smaller picture because um, they were counting the whole canvas and so it ended up being a little smaller than I was expecting and that's why it does look a little bit pixelated um, especially if you're up close to it but from far away it does look pretty nice um, overall I did like this company a lot so um, this one again it was called Forest Bridge um, and Everyday Deals what I liked about them is that they have um, I think it's year-round a deal where you can get these kind of smaller ones for uh, $3.99 plus shipping so for me let's see shipping was $5.99 so and I live in California in the United States so total I paid a little less than $10 for this guy um, and I'm actually new to diamond painting so I did kind of want to start with a cheaper one and one that was smaller and round because I heard rounds were easier um, so I wanted to kind of see if I was gonna like it before I went all in with the square which some people say is harder um, or with a bigger one which you know then I was gonna be committing to a lot more than just this little small guy here um, spoiler alert I loved it so I think I will be doing a lot more diamond paintings in the future um, I actually have a really big square one on the way it's uh, 60 centimeters by 120 so I don't know if that was too big of a step to take from 30 by 40 to 60 by 120 but we will find out <laughs> so anyways um, like I said 30 by 40 full round um, less than ten dollars total this actually arrived really quickly so it came from China but I got it in less than two weeks so I was not expecting that I was expecting a whole month and since this was my first one I didn't have any piled up like other other youtubers do so um, I was <laughs> anxiously awaiting this guy and I was like I don't think I can do a whole month but luckily it came in less than two weeks so um, delivery time was great uh, it came how did it come it wasn't in a box it was uh, kind of half rolled half folded in one of those envelopes from the mail um, so there were a few folds which you can kind of make out in the back I think you can kind of see it yeah you can kind of see these folds I I laid some textbooks um, over the canvas to try to straighten it out but they didn't quite come out but honestly you can't really tell and um, as far as rivers, I, there were no rivers, no bubbles. Um, the drills all stuck down really nicely. Um, yeah, I think, I don't know if this is poured glue or not, but I don't think it was double-sided tape. I, the glue was really nice. It, the diamonds stuck to it really well, but I could still slide them around pretty easily. So I'm just going to give you guys... An up close look at this guy. Very sparkly in this lighting. Also, bear with me as I get my setup figured out. I know this isn't the best lighting right now, but um, I will be figuring out my setup within the next few weeks. So I think it turned out pretty good. So I liked that there was a key on both the top and the bottom so that if I covered it with something uh, you know the wax paper I could still see it from both ends um, did not come with an inventory sheet but I did have enough diamonds so that was no problem um, I know you guys like to see how they designate the symbols 
So first they do the numbers. Sorry, I'm trying to get this guy to focus. First they do the numbers, there we go. And then they move on down to the letters. So I had no problems reading this or differentiating anything. It was very clear, very easy, um, very fun project to do overall. And let's see if I can get it to focus again. Okay, um, let's take a look at the drills. So as far as trash, and this is what I'm doing right now because I'm somewhat new to this, so I don't have everything organized yet. But for the trash, I wanted to put it in this egg carton because I felt like that was just the easiest thing to do for me. So this is my trash, and there's kind of a lot, but I also was being very picky. So it wasn't just if there was an extra tab or misshapen. Sometimes there was just a very slight little thing that I didn't like, <laughs> and so I picked them out. Um, I don't know if I mentioned this, but I am a perfectionist, so I wanted everything to look really good. Um... The only areas I really was kind of struggling with the drills was number one and number 20. Um, these just had a lot of really misshapen drills, so I put some aside just to kind of show you an example. If I can get it to focus. Yeah, so that guy's an example of an extra tab, but these guys are just sorry, not a great shape. So it might not look that obvious now, but when you put them in with all the other perfect circles, um, those misshapen ones really stand out. So um, that's why I had a lot of those green guys were like that. So that was a little, a little bit of a pain to go through that extra step, but in the end, it wasn't really that bad just extra extra time um and then luckily it wasn't a problem because i had lots of extra so the ones are a little lacking just because so many of them went to the trash pile but as you can see with most of the other ones i had plenty extra and this is a small one so i didn't need a small painting so i didn't need tons of drills but i mean there's a lot in there so uh no worries about running out except for maybe the green but Again, I could just be less picky and use some of the misshapen ones. I just didn't want to. But yeah, overall, I do think that I would recommend Everyday Deals to anyone who's getting started. Um, they do, their $3.99 deal does seem to mainly have the rounds and the 30 by 40, which, as I said earlier, is actually 25 by 30. So, um, you're not going to get great detail and find those, you know, those beautiful big ones that you want, but they actually do have a, a deal. It's, um, buy one, get one. And on those ones, they have some of those bigger, um, like three panel ones and some squares. So there are options for you if you want something other than this, but I think this is a great place to start. Um, and I know AliExpress also has some smaller ones that are really cheap too. Um, but I think shipping might take a little bit longer on those ones, whereas this one came in less than two weeks. So I'm not sure if that's going to be the case for everyone, but at least for me. And I ordered, let's see, I ordered the end of December 2019. So it's past Christmas, but still could be when, you know, they're having a rush of things. So the fact that they got it here this quickly um, really impressed me. And yeah, I'm trying to think if there's anything else. Um, the canvas is pretty good. It's pretty thick, but I will say there was some fraying along the edges so um just something to be aware of but not a big deal I haven't decided if I'm gonna frame this one or stick it on a poster board or what I'm gonna do with it yet but um yeah I overall this one was really fun to do really high quality everything looks good to me easy to read easy to stick the diamonds to um oh it came with one of the just it was a very basic package the single placer pen and that the small green uh tray sorry i don't have them with me right now <laughs> but um it came with the very basics no multi-placer um no tweezers but i just used my own it didn't really matter the, the plastic tweezers 
don't really help me that much anyways. Um, yeah, I had everything you needed to get started, just not some of the more luxurious items. Um, but yeah, this is what it looks like. It's got some nice shine to it. So that will be it for my post review for everyday deals. Um, I hope you guys liked this video. Let me know um, if there's anything else that you would have liked to know about this that I can include in my next video. Um, or if there's anything you want to see from me, any questions you have for me. I'm just getting started in this, so um, I'm really open to whatever you guys would like to see. So thank you for watching.